Hi everybody. This is my baby. I'm Look at him. I'm a grown man. Ah, but he'll always right? Once a baby, always a baby. Thanks for watching. Hey, this is Corey. Introduce yourself to the people, man. Um, Introduce yourself to the people, man. <laughs> yes, I'm Corey Newman. Ah. Uh, um, Jamaican boy. Jamaican. Oh, I'm saying, oh yeah, yeah. sorry, I'm a Jamaican. <laughs> but, um, yeah. but anyway, guess what? Never surprised him because you know, living in the north, you know, get certain things. Like sometimes, uh, like Florida. Yeah, yeah, I'm the current sender, you know. So I have a June plum fee, I peel and put some salt on it. You know how that go. You already salted it? You don't know about them things, there. Eh? I do. You don't know Jamaica too early. You know, we used to buy June plum in a bag curry with salt. No, because no, no. nobody couldn't sell out a Hydeal gate. You remember? <laughs> <laughs> but we who go primary school, we know how that go. You get your two June plum, or if you have money. Wait, I did, didn't I? You did, but, but not from school. We used to buy it from school. And you guys used to I be remember. picked up. When school you over? At school. At school? Or but nobody out there not sell. Them couldn't sell. Vendors couldn't be outside of Hydel, I remember. I remember having a bag or two. Maybe let me put it in there gear. So you can get the real feel. Because that's a real deal, you know. When you put the June plum in the bag and, and you put some salt on it and you rub it up so. Yeah. Cause you see if you look at money when you come from school, you know. Did you do so um, that you can buy June plum? Did you do green mango? Or is salt no. and pepper? No, or but I knew. Did the, I think. Yeah. One of our friends in Jamaica used to love the do everything green. She put pepper, black pepper, and salt on it. I don't know if you guys know about that, but yeah, some people do that. But when we remember in New York, when we went to New York, mm -hmm. and we, we bought the where we used to go when mom was there, and we bought the mangoes on the street. And they used to put and then slice up the mango, and then you, you, you had the option you Isn't could use like the, salt the or yes, the people yeah. on the street, the it's to. The I Spanish. think it's Tampico or something this season they, they Oh, but sometimes it could be just salt I used to just yeah, get salt be, on mine just... Yeah, but then put some people put even paprika or something on it too mm -hmm. But the original, like we say, you saw it a sweat? You saw my jumper my sweating on the bag? I can't see Ah, it a sweat of the juice, this <laughs> <laughs> So talk up let me know. Drop a comment. Who remember the June plum in the bag? When you pour, maybe you can't rub a one June plum. But when you keep them kind of set so, you can buy a three June plum out in your bag. Then you just uh, eat it and uh, walk or come home from school. Not no sweet so. So enjoy. Enjoy, my son. Thank Bring you it back to reality. <laughs> they miss these things, you know? They really miss these things. Mm. Tastes good, though. Let me know tell you one. They hit it though. I just bit it and it's like memory. I know, like nostalgic. <laughs> Even when you feel the little spikes of mm, the seed. Mm. Mm. I want to say thank you to my sister in Florida, <laughs> my sister Karen, who took the time to hunt June Plum and send for us here in the north. Thank you very much, Karen. I love you. Mmm. <laughs> mmm. That's good. Mm -hmm. mm. We have three on some three auto leave and these look the fittest. Mm. So I knew that these would ripe the best. So I picked out these three. So I mm. have one, Corey has one, and I'm saving one for my girlfriend um that lives here. Not to well, probably about half an hour from us. She's close to me. She though, lucky right? so she's special. I'm not special friend me I'm doing them. So I would have fight if them and all live close by. So if you're <laughs> an excuse is that you live close by. Big up yourself, Cherry. <laughs> mm -mm. You remember, don't cry. Everything just come back. I know. Well, this stuff like this is just normal here. It would just be normal, yeah, you know? Well, it's like a Jamaican Detroit area. And there's shipping and customs. Well, so in order, <laughs> in order for these things to be normal, you have to live at Jamaica, Papa. Mm -hmm. Miss home. 
Mm -hmm. I, mean, I didn't see any peanut man <laughs> walking ah! down the street. <laughs> yeah. I'm riding bicycle with the with the, mm -hmm. the thing with the fire in the back and with the, the whistle peanut. Sound. And the whistle, yeah. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Dig up all that peanut man there. Remember that. Little things, little things, man. Bring back, bring back nostalgia. I miss Ginnip too. Mm -hmm. Because with Ginnip, they love Ginnip, you know. Especially when a Ginnip season in Jamaica. But now I go just borrow. When I come home, I go to the road, I come home with like three different type of Ginnip. Type? Some different people. type? Well, not really tight, but mm. some guinea sweeter than some. Some more fleshy than some. Mm -hmm. And some people might not want to give you a taste, right? You just have to buy it. Some people might not want to give you a taste. So in such case, I would pick up like one bunch of guinea from this person. And as my walk girl, I might pick up a bunch from somebody else. So one of them must good because it's very important for me to get some good guinea for eat. You know? Remember when we teach you to feed guinea for me used to crack the seed? Mm-hmm. How <laughs> <laughs> oh, the for our babies, our kids, young kids, we used to crack the seed and then give it, give it to them. I know them, I'm a boy, them a big I man from people. That. We used to crack the seed and in you know, our mouth and give them. A war. <laughs> yeah, man. Good man. <laughs> you remember the day when we did introduce a young child to thinking Todo? It was... What were we doing? It was in the. I bought it. Yeah, we were in the backyard. In the backyard, we sat on the ground in the backyard. The way it looked a concrete part, yeah. Um, and then I break it. I'm teaching you how to eat it. You guys were sitting on both sides of me, one mm. on each side. And um, I'm trying to remember what it. I'm making to eat it off, like. and then now when I'm finished with it, now I'm teaching you how to rub the seed. On the side of the sink, cause the mm -hmm. concrete, rub it, rub it, and then burn each other. Remember? Yeah. It sounds very pleasant, <laughs> doesn't it? Yeah, but my my friend them know all the thing go. What yeah. is the? I forget what it's the called. The burning part? No, the the actual flesh or the taste of the thing. Oh well, it, it's kind of dusty, so? chalky, but sweet. But it does have a kind of stinky taste, kind of you know, and mm -hmm. but it's not stinking toe, you know. It's stinking toe. Right? Tinkin. It's tinking toe, not stinking toe, right? I always thought stinking. Mm, no, tinking toe. Right, people? <laughs> Let him know how this thing goes. Drop a. Hit the, hit the thumbs up button, right? You know we need the thumbs up. Hit the thumbs up button. <laughs> Please. <laughs> yeah, man. But if you're uncomfortable about stinking toe, no. One and two people might have said that, but primarily tinking toe. Because I really thought it was important. For you guys to to experience those things, you know. Yeah, like culture. Yeah, it's very important. So remember, even the other day when you went back a few years ago, and you just, were. It was nice to go. It was um, you, what Smiley's place. Oh, the and vineyard, yeah, Smiley Vineyard, big up Smiley. <laughs> you see the echoes falling off the trees. And Did that bring back memories though? Yeah, I'm like. Cause that was a playground for you guys. You yeah, know? I remember the area. It's like it changed up a bit. But yeah. Still, I'm like. Yeah, it was like an just, oasis. You guys me, just yeah. go in there and a play, and yeah, the plum tree there, the front, and the guinea tree there over there. So, and then we know, it's one of our brethren where have a vineyard. We call it a vineyard. We have a big enough garden, and him have him him like a um. What do you call that? Him have look him like a house. Him have like it. I said them. No, they will come with mini house. It have mini house mm -hmm. from long time, you right? That's what they call it. No, they have the mini, mini, mini homes or mini houses, something like that. But he had a mini mm -hmm. house from long time inside his vineyard, well kept, nice, set up, nice. And the kids used to love to go over there because so many implant up so many different. It was like this oasis in the middle of the city. Because remember, the football field is there, dry yeah, and dirt. You know, concrete homes all around. Then here, you just you just make a few steps and you reach into Smiley Vineyard. I didn't and there. His home. Yeah, I don't remember it's in, in there. his house. I it's just remember it's like nature and right. Because when you go, it fruit. was so that part was so refreshing to me. I remember in that 
you're outside with the street light and everything you walk from over our house and you walk across and you enter the vineyard especially at night time you enter the vineyard and you're sitting there reasoning with smiley right this is a rastafarian man you're reasoning with him and then you can hear it's as if you're going to country you can actually hear the the crickets mm -hmm. because like, of all the well, trees well. and you know you have aki tree with not stop beer the aki tree the beer all year round aki guinep plant beer? banana you know so many things so many things and them have this big tank in the middle too and them have yeah. a fish tank my fish tank the fish them so big now last time we went they had a big fish tank like made in you know oh, yeah, it's nice and turtles he had that I, don't I remember think they tried to reach in. Oh, they just like die at you. <laughs> okay, yeah, man. Yeah, he is like the coolest. That was house. the coolest yeah. little spot. The coolest little spot. Everybody want to be there, and don't make him be a pudding. <laughs> the um, Jamaican. Because one day me go for after the word reach me now, so smile a break, big pudding. You know. I mean, me hurry up, walk fast, cut across the field. Now I uh, go in and smile. I say, as me go in, me say, smiley. I come for my pudding. You're smelly, I said. Because I'm called Matina. Because, <laughs> <you> get that name? <laughs> because there was a time, remember me and Delene would have we here out. And it's high true. as young, you know, 20s. Mm -hmm. And I guess you were here, the out so big and natural. Him said, and Tina Turner here always so high. Him, him called me Tina. So I'm still <laughs> called me Tina. So I go ahead and say, Boy, Tina, you know, so the pudding done. Hurt. Pain. <laughs> Painful, you hear me? Come and walk fast, go for dinner. Can I go for my pudding? Smell it. But anyway, yeah, man. We enjoy this. There are some people that are like staples in our community, especially who bring positivity and good vibes, right? Auntie. Huh? Auntie Jackie. Oh, oh, yeah. She's a staple man. The neighborhood. She's a staple man. Cat's eye. Cat said, Winnie Park, mm -hmm. big up yourself. A mother cat said that. Highly respected. Yeah, man. Enough blessings. Positivity and hopefulness. Yeah, man. She just had a yeah, fish, man. fish fry. Yeah, it was good. Instagram. It was good. It mm -hmm. was good. You know, it took a turn up. I know cat said things said. Food sell off. Please remember, if you mess mm -hmm. with cat side food, you know, at that you want to eat all the time. So, you. <laughs> Check her out. Mama Ketsai, Jackie Ketsai, Palm Milton Avenue, Dwayne Park. Yeah, man. A real deal. And she had a variety of stuff at the fish fry. You realize that? Yeah. I'm yeah. trying to mm -hmm. see her Instagram page. Mm -hmm. What's her Instagram? Is it Mama, Mother, Mother Ketsai? Mad Cat. Mother, um, Mother. Mother? Yeah. Mother Ketsai? Yeah. You can see the name. Is it gonna focus? I don't think they can see that. Yeah. And that's the fish. Oh, oh, the okay. Food from so how you said the, the how you said the Instagram name? Oh just Mada One yeah. word? Mm-hmm. Mm. Mada Catsai on Instagram. Garling. Mm -hmm. Hurry, oh, you know, deal with the jump from seat right you now. Yeah. Them thing have to clean out, you know. Where is yours? I'm gonna reach down my saying. Oh, I'm gonna clean out my one jump from for the whole year. I think this is a very good job. Mm -mm. You have to go down in the creases between the things, them. I feel like just chewing up the whole thing. You can do that too. We used to do that to the soft one, then, but if it's hard, don't mess with it. They, um, hurt your teeth. It's well seasoned. <laughs> it's well seasoned. <laughs> you mm -hmm. taste the salt and the sweet. This is so good. The salt kind of do that, you know. I think salt kind of make sour things kind of taste sweet when you put it on it. The flavor enhancer. Mm -hmm. 
All right, who did it better? Hmm? Who did it better? Oh, man, come here, Richard. Oh, wait. <laughs> Mom have some of them now. That she's supposed to mm -hmm. a stew. She got the stew drink from. Did I have that? I don't know. Let's just stew it with ginger and sh sugar. That's boil good. it down, boil it down. Only if you could make a preserve. It's like a preserve. Jam. It's like a preserve, but this is also in it. So it's when you spoon out some and you eat around it and you eat it. You have to eat it little because it's sweet, you know. And then we get down to this now. That's how you bite it up. <laughs> For real. Oh, got mm -hmm. Thanks for watching that video, guys. We really hope you enjoyed it. Remember to like, remember to subscribe, and remember to share. Share everywhere. everywhere.